Good morning, everyone. So it's 7.05 this morning and I'm just getting ready for class. My name's Ashley and I'm a marketing and HR student at SFU's Beatty School of Business. I keep my routine the same every morning, whether I'm getting ready for work or for school. That way it helps to save time as well as I know how long it takes me to get ready every morning, which is about 35 minutes. I'm gonna quickly make my bed and then put on my makeup and then get going for the day. I have classes at SFU Surrey and Burnaby today. So I wanted to make sure that I was dressed warm, even though it's sunny out, it's gonna be quite cool on campus. And I know that I'm checking out the winter warm up with my friends this afternoon. So I wanted to make sure that I was dressed for the weather. BD offers most of its classes at both SFU Burnaby and Surrey. This semester, I'm taking a 200 level quantitative class at SFU Surrey twice a week. And what I love about the campus is that it's super open, so it lets a lot of natural light in, as well as there's tons of study spaces available on campus. So today the professor just went over what concepts will be tested on for the final, as well as a quick review of some of the concepts we had covered earlier in the semester. So I just got to SFU Burnaby from SFU Surrey campus. It took about 30 minutes to drive here, which is pretty good. And I'm actually headed over to the academic quadrangle, or as we call it, AQ, to meet up with some teammates to discuss our group project. Even though SFU Burnaby is quite large, it is our main campus. So during the fall and spring semesters, it can get busy really quickly. So I always like to make sure I have enough time built into my schedule to find parking as well as find a spot to study on campus. Today, I'm just meeting up with some group mates to work on our final marketing assignment. So James and I are just headed to go get a smoothie on campus. James, how are you today? I'm good, excited for the day. Good, except for the presentation? Super excited. Okay, so we're just gonna go through our presentation now. Should I not wait? No, it's okay, that's fine. So our presentation is called The Rise and Fall of Victoria's Secret. And our group is the one in the back, my name is Marilyn. My name is James. And their market share dropped from 33% to 24% as they failed to adapt to the changing world. The last component of this 300 level marketing class is a tutorial presentation. So we all met up as a group just to go over the presentation one last time, as well as ask any questions that we think may come up during the Q&A. We're just headed to go get some food now. What are you feeling? Okay, I might get some curry. We'll see. Today, Marilyn and I are just headed to McKenzie Cafe, which is the main student cafeteria at SFU Burnaby. Something I really appreciate about SFU that I didn't discover until I had started doing event planning was that all the drinkware and cutlery on campus are actually 100% biodegradable. Now that I have some food in my stomach, I'm gonna head to my last class of the day, which is employment law. Employment law is a 400 level HR class and is actually the last HR class I have to take in my degree. Because the process is long and drawn out when there's commercial dispute and parties go to court. It's not instantaneous. You have to go. Now that I'm officially done classes for the day, I'm headed over to Convo Mall to meet up with some friends at the winter warm up. Every fall semester, SFU hosts a winter warm up at all three of our main campuses. It's a really great way to meet other students as well as faculty members, as well as SFU actually provides free activities and treats for us to enjoy. Are you okay? Yeah. So I just wrapped up my classes for the day. Now I'm heading to my car. Okay, so I'm gonna head home and get some studying in. Hey. Cause when I think of Victoria's Secret, I kind of think the opposite of intimate. Like I know it's like their intimate clothing, but I think of like, they're more flashy. So I actually have a couple of hours to kill before my event. I'm just gonna quickly throw something on the stove and make a quick bite to eat. I'm about to head off to the Bass Mentorship Program Pitch Off event tonight happening at the Pinnacle Hotel. The last thing I like to do before I head to a networking event is actually pack my bag. So here I'm packing my wallet with some ID as well as whatever cash I might need for the cash bar. Hand sanitizer and hand cream. Tissues. 
These are little stain remover pads. Mints are definitely preferable over gum. That way you're not chewing in people's faces. A pen, some pain relief medication, some blotting papers, some lip products. I always like to bring my business cards in a card case. That way the corners don't get bent. Most events are catered, but I always like to bring some granola bars just in case I get low blood sugar. And the last thing I pack is actually a charging bank. Another thing I like to bring, of course, is a charging cable, but this one's nice because it's actually hidden in a tassel. So it looks like an accessory as opposed to a huge cable that's taking up space in your bag. As for the bag itself, I always like to bring something with a shoulder strap or a crossbody. That way you can just throw it over your shoulder and you have both hands free to shake people's hands as well as hold your glass for the night. So I'm at BMP Pitch Off right now. I'm here with Sandra. Hello. <laughs> and Tina. <laughs> BAS is the Business Administration Student Society. BAS Mentorship Program pairs first-year students with experienced senior students and helps them navigate their first semester at SFU. Making those connections? Oh, yeah. Pitch Off is essentially a networking event and allows the first-year students to pitch themselves to industry professionals. So they're gonna announce the finalists of BMP Pitch Off soon. So I'm really excited because I've heard some incredible pitches. I don't know how they're gonna pick the top three, but it's gonna be a really tight race. So our finalists are, congratulations to Mario. Yes! <laughs> Shaw. These are the lovely individuals who put on tonight's event. Big round of applause for them. So ladies, what was your favorite part of the night? Seeing our mentees grow and become more confident. And the food. I just got home from BMP Pitch Off and I'm thoroughly exhausted, but I want to give a huge shout out to all the first years who put themselves out there tonight. They did an incredible job and it's always so rewarding to see the progress that you guys make throughout the night. And congratulations to the four finalists and of course, Andy, the winner of Pitch Off 2019. So I just got in my PJs and I'm gonna start getting ready for bed. So because my schedule can look really different from day to day, I like to keep the same routine every night. That way it helps to signal to my body that it's time to go to bed. For me, that consists of washing my face and brushing my teeth while I'm watching a TV show in the background. Thank you so much for following along for my day in the life. This is Ashley signing off. <laughs>